I'm Kim with Touch Bionics, and we make different prostheses for upper limb amputees. One of the prostheses we make is called Living Skin. These prostheses are considered passive functional prostheses. They are made from silicone, and each one's custom sculpted and painted for an individual patient. So you can see we can do things like incorporate hair or tattoos or freckles for different patients to make it mimic the appearance of their sound side. Our artists pay a lot of attention to the sculpting as well as the pigmentation of each prosthesis. While I've been showing you this prosthesis, I've been holding it with my prosthesis. So again, it's considered passive functional because I don't have active grasp with it, but I do have the ability to passively hold on to different objects, thus freeing up this hand to do my fine motor skills, and I use the prosthesis for the gross motor tasks. Primarily, the patients that we fit with living skin prostheses are finger amputees. So we can make anything from a full finger for somebody to a partial finger, like a thumb tip for them. We also work with lower extremity amputees, and we can do toes, partial feet, and full feet for them. Each prosthesis has a clear skin on the outside, and the painting's done intrinsically, which gives them a nice depth and translucency, like real skin. These coverings can also go over electric prostheses, so if somebody would rather wear an electric hand, we can make a nice looking glove to go over that prosthesis. I'm going to let my coworker talk to you now because he's wearing an electric hand. My name is Roger Thomas. I'm with Touch Bionics. What I'm demonstrating today is the uh, eye limb, and it has five movable fingers, and the thumb actually rotates over and back. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab a ball, and you'll see that by grabbing the ball like that, I can hold it, open it, I can even grasp it completely up. The cool part about this is that each finger is powered individually. So when I grab a cup, the pinky actually goes underneath the cup. So if we are talking and I had drink and I was accidentally got distracted and went like that, the cup does not fall out of my hand like other prosthetics. That is the eye limb and the eye touch hand. So that's it. One of the other prostheses that Touch Bionics makes is called a Pro Digits. It's a partial hand prosthesis that has electrically powered fingers. So we can make anywhere from one to five electrically powered fingers for somebody who's had a through the hand amputation. If their amputation was similar to one of these levels, then we could fit them with electric fingers. This is the first prosthesis that has had that ability that is available to patients to wear and bring home with them.